I've had a few conversations with a few local head teachers. The consensus between them seems to be that Portishead is marketed as a town suitable for families, but then doesn't provide enough for the over eights to do. Yeah. There is a reasonable amount of play equipment for toddlers and young children, but after that, children seem to be considered as a nuisance. If you look at the needs of children for proper social, physical and emotional development, it is well known that young boys particularly need an outlet for their energies and somewhere to play where they can take physical risks within a safe environment. A fully overlooked skate or wheels park fulfills this need admirably. The devil finds work for idle hands comes to mind as well. You will surely have problems in a town our size if young people are, are, are at a loose end and are not considered. In a week when it has been reported that the UK has dropped from 11th to 156 globally in the league tables in provision for children and their rights, it is sad to think that the so-called fastest growing town in Europe could well be at the bottom of the list within the UK. That's our town. Just as North Somerset is currently at the bottom of the league tables for social care. All of this is actually rather disgraceful. And councillors presiding over such a legacy should be deeply ashamed of themselves. In one of the wealthiest towns in our country, in the fifth richest country in the world, and all the dinosaurs at the top turn their backs on our children yeah. and ignore the wishes of our residents. Yeah. 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 Yeah.